what are angle of elevation and angle of depression angle of elevation now to study angle of elevation we consider that we have an observer standing on the ground and he observe an aeroplane flying in the sky then the line joining the eyes of the observer and the point on the aeroplane which he is viewing is known as the line of sight and the horizontal line passing through the eyes of the observer is known as the horizontal level the angle between the line of sight and the horizontal level is the angle of elevation so now we can define the angle of elevation the angle of elevation of the point viewed is the angle formed by the line of sight with the horizontal level when the point is viewed above the horizontal level right there is a trick to remember the angle of elevation the angle of elevation is always formed when we have to raise our head to view the object so in this case the observer will certainly have to raise the head to view the aeroplane right so in this case the angle of elevation is formed so you have to just connect that we have to raise our hand with angle of elevation remember this simple connection and you will never forget what is angle of elevation okay now angle of depression so this is a road and there's a tower observer standing on it he views a car so this will be the line of sight of the observer and this will be the horizontal level so so the angle formed between the horizontal level and the line of sight in this case when the object is below the observer is known as the angle of depression right so we can define the angle of depression of a point on the object being viewed is the angle formed by the line with the horizontal when the point is below the horizontal level okay so similarly you can remember the angle of depression the angle of depression is always formed when we have to lower our head to view the object so lower our head and angle of depression you have to just connect them and you will never forget what is angle of depression right now there is a relation between the angle of elevation and angle of depression so consider that we have a tower like this and observer 1 is standing on it and we have an observer 2 standing on the ground so this is the horizontal level for observer 1 this is the horizontal level for observer 2 and they view each other so this will be the line of sight in the first case this angle between the horizontal level and the line of sight will be the angle of depression and in this case for the observer 2 the angle between the horizontal level and the line of sight would be angle of elevation okay now because horizontal level for both observer would be parallel so angle of depression would be equal to angle of elevation because between two parallel lines a transversal forms the alternative angles then alternative angles are equal right so we can give a relation between the angle of elevation and angle of depression is this that angle of depression is equal to angle of of elevation that is they are numerically equal for the same line of sight so observer 1 and observer 2 have the same line of sight so the angle of depression would be equal to angle of elevation okay i hope this is quite sufficient of what we have to know about the angle of elevation and angle of depression Thank you. Please support us by subscribing to our channel, by liking this video and giving your comment for the video.